I'm here with Peter Waugh, uh, Straight Area Community Curling Club President. Peter, congratulations uh, on the recently opened uh, reopening of your curling club. Tell me a little bit about the background as to how you got here to, with this new expansion. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, Bob. We're very pleased to be opening our new club. Uh, basically, this project's been in the making for probably three, four, five, even up to five years. The last year, we started construction this summer in August, and we just finished uh, construction uh, last week, and we started up on Friday night with a uh, open house and a fun night. Okay, so Lee Curling started on uh, January the 17th. That's a, a big plus. Let, tell me about the, the differences or the changes yeah. that people will see when they come in uh, yeah. physically uh, into this building. Okay. Well, if you were comparing the old club and this club, it'll be a radical difference. People will really notice the difference if they haven't seen the club during construction. It's a much superior building, you know, much higher elevation. The big difference, I suppose, for us is, is it has a much better insulation system and the, has a concrete ice pad so that all the refrigeration piping is embedded in concrete and that helps with both the quality of the ice and the consistency and allows us probably to start the season earlier and run later. The extra sheet uh, gives 50% more curling uh, availability and uh, allows for much better ice times for the legs, for the bond spiels, uh, allows uh, groups such as uh, say uh, Port Hood and out that way down Route 19 they can come in and curl at earlier times so we hope that that would uh, attract more people to come curling. We are certainly hoping to grow both the membership the amount of juniors that are you know which are, will be the future of the club we'd love to have more juniors participate we hope to have a, a larger adult, adult population plus we're able to host different community events like the YMCA uses our curling club we're going to have a bond spiel this year with the Rock Center and allows more organizations to participate in the sport of curling. Uh, the, the first uh, group to come to the table and provide us a grant was the federal government under the stimulus program, the Recreation Infrastructure. And then the province uh, came through with the Recreation Facilities Grant. The two of those brought us to the, poss the realm of possibility. And then we did some fundraising and we had a tremendous response from the local community. Uh, club members and local businesses and like all together they made this a reality. Well, this weekend is going to be our, our single biggest bond spiel of the year, and with that bond spiel, we're doing a grand opening ceremony. So we've invited uh, our sponsors, the government officials, the media, and uh, basically old curlers, new curlers. Uh, we're hoping to have a big turnout on, on the weekend. We got 24 teams playing, and uh, on Saturday afternoon at four o'clock, we'll, we'll do our grand opening ceremony for this new facility.